Hey, this is Sam Bass, co-lead designer of Command & Conquer 4, and I'm here to take you through one of our campaign missions, Transport Down. You'll see there is our deploy zone. And what do you deploy there? Well, you deploy one of our three classes. So for the start of this mission, I'm going to start out as a fence. Deploy here in my deploy zone. Deployment successful, Commander. Standing by for your next order. So I got my tanks. Yes. And up here looks like there is a forgotten farm, which is where the mutants in this area live. Now they tend to not be very friendly until I've taken control of their structure. You'll notice that we're also, because we have a higher CP cap, worth of units within range of the structure, we're also capturing it. Note that by shooting this structure we can also speed up the capture while it's under enemy control. So this point, the structure is neutral to me. We've wiped out the enemies. I'm going to also pick up some of these crates, which have the fun advantage of not only healing me, but also letting me gain a level. And then we got it captured. I can now purchase uh, forgotten units. However, as I am at my command point cap, as you can see there, I'm going to have to lose some stuff before I can do that. And there you will see one of our escape pods, which is being held down by these rather unpleasant forgotten units. So what we've unpacked are two zone raiders, which are GDI defense units, very, very powerful uh, tier two units. I'm going to upgrade those, give them some veterancy. So at this point, what I'm going to do, get my engineer, and I'm going to send him over here to the Mastodon Husk. You'll see his stealth detect radius is visible on the map. So I'm going to get him in there, and bam, I have a Mastodon. Now this is already a powerful unit, but what I'm going to do so I'm going to upgrade it. I'm going to walk over to some of these upgrade crates and turn them into a real force to be reckoned with. As you can see, the uh, iron back, the forgotten unit, is very much... It's like a custom-built mech made in someone's garage. It's meant to have a, a little more of a handmade vibe than the GDI or Nod units you find. So, got some more units here. I'm going to rank up some of my infantry. And our good friend there is telling us that we have a plan. We know what we need to do. And what we need to do is capture the Tiberium control nodes. So at this point, I'm going to grab my guys and head off for the nearest node. So these guys are starting to capture it. Same capturing mechanic as in capturing the mutant structures. These are also our primary multiplayer goals, but they play a significant role in the story also. That is captured, belongs to GDI. Until Nod is now on the battlefield, that's the Nod Defense Crawler stomping around. There's the Scorpion tank over there. Oh, the Nod Defense Crawler has gone straight for TCN node that I only have one unit over. I also see that they're in hot pursuit of me over here. So they are capturing the structure. So I've got two of these things captured. And the Mastodon's making quick work of this Nod Avenger tank. Get him, boy. There you go. Good and dead. And I'm going to put him in guard mode of that structure. Objective complete. Offensive glass already. Okay, so it looks like we completed that objective. As you can see, we have a procedural damage system as units take damage, especially our larger units. You see parts of them blow off, you see, based on where they're hit. Oh no, and he went down. Oh, and look, our good friends at GI have sent us some reinforcements. So here we have some combat. Nod's moving in, ready to take our stuff out. What we're going to do is have this guy debuff their weapons. There you go. Their weapons are debuffed. And then send my guys in, finish them off good. Yeah. Don't stand a chance. Nice work. We're approaching 100%. Let's get the hell out of here. A unit is under attack. And that's it. Thank you very much for watching this walkthrough. I hope you enjoyed it. It's, this is one of the many exciting missions in CNC4, which is coming to stores near you March 16th. Buy it. You'll like it. <laughs>